Hey, good afternoon, Map here, Map Investments. I want to talk to you about Brightcove. I'm doing some videos on some small cap stocks that have been performing very well for me. And also, the small cap index, uh, the Russell index, has been on a very um, uh, quick uptrend with a lot of people looking for these smaller undervalued companies that are growing quickly. Um, one of them that has been been performing very nicely for me is Bright Cove. Um, let me pull up the chart here. It has a market cap of 700 million and has a low float of 39 million shares. Um, it's held by 87% institutions, mutual funds, and they're in the IT services sector. Uh, you, can, you can read here the company profile is a global provider of cloud-based services for video. The company products and services include Brightcove Video Cloud, Brightcove Zencoder, Brightcove Once. So they're, they're in that cloud uh, arena. If you look at the chart here, I, I, I picked this one up. Uh, I've been watching this one for a while and I picked it up. Uh, before it started uh, really uh, moving. Let me pull up the three month chart. I picked it up more or less like in the 11 range. And if you look at this chart, it's just been going on an uptrend. And that's the one year, it's the five year. Big buying in there. It's had a big run. Um, I'm up nicely on this one. The stock hit a 52-week high on Friday. And uh, if you read the news here, the, you see here on uh, October 21st, Bicro shares are trading higher after the company reported better expected Q3 PS and sales results. And the company also issued Q4 and 20 sales guidance above the Wall Street estimate. If you look here, Bicro's three... Uh, Q3 earnings per share were 11 cents compared to a loss of two cents, and their sales were 49 million. Uh, they beat the 46 million estimate that uh, the Wall Street had uh, anticipated. So, my um, I bought a call option on this one when it was much lower before the breakout, uh, but this is one to keep an eye on. It made a new 52 week high, and um. It's been it's been uh, acting very nicely. Here's the chart, the weekly chart. You can see that's kind of like breaking out. Hit 18 after hours on Friday, and you got some big buy bars, and you got 95 uh, RSI, meaning that there's a strong buying in there. Here's the monthly chart. Looks very nice. Um, let me put it here sideways. I hate to flip the video on you, but. If you see here, stock can maybe get to um, 25. Let's take a look at the, uh, at the uh, here are the fundamentals. So you can see here on the 2021 and, 20, 2021 and 2020, their estimates are, are 29 cents a share and, three, and 36 cents. So very big uh, upswings in the earning per shares on this stock and has high rating, composite rating of 98. Um, and here's the, the, the quick recap develops cloud-based professional digital media and publishing and distribution software. It's been around since 2012. Down here are the, are the metrics. So let me pull up the option chain and the TD Ameritrade. Like I said, I picked up, uh, the options pretty cheap on this one and, uh, it's doing very well. I'm up 200%. Um, I have the April, you can see it's highlighted there with the green flag, and the anticipated move is $5 uh, from here to April. That will put it at uh, in the 20, you know, 23, 24 ballpark, and by July, a $7 move. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm up pretty nicely on this. I might, on another uptick, if we get some more movement, I might be, anticipate, uh, might be tempted to sell a a call against my long um, to collect some premium. So I'm, I'm gonna be looking at the 22 and uh, actually I might go into January. Might look to do maybe a 20, a 20 call here 
Uh, let's see what kind of delta this has. Has 30% delta, uh, 30 delta. So that means that your probability of success on that trade are 70, that those options will expire uh, worthless. So I might sell something against that because I've had a pretty good run up and I have a over 200% return on Bright Cove. Um, please uh, like the, the video, share it, comment, subscribe. And I hope uh, you liked uh, my recap on Bright Cove. Thank you.